Man, I gotta confess, I don't, I don't know who Gerald Salente is. And um, before, before just a couple of months ago, I didn't know who Max Kaiser was, or Eric Sprott, or Lindsey Williams. And even now, I barely care. <laughs> Uh, silver futurist kind of ends up being my my pivot man for this alternative media. I know who Rush Limbaugh is. I know uh, Neil Boards. Uh, who's who's that other guy? You know the guy with that accent. Um, Michael Savage. I know about Michael Savage. Uh, Glenn Beck. <laughs> what a buttery voice he's got. Wow. Buy his book, right? Buy his book. So anyway, putting uh, putting the baby boomers who vote as a unit, who think as a unit, who exist as a unit all together and figuring out what they want. I don't know, man. I think I can't I can't go against anything that we've said in our conversation yet. And for those of you who are not aware, uh, let me see. I'm gonna. I don't have time for this stuff, but you know what I'm going to do? I am going to link the series of videos. I think it starts out, uh, Randy Tooth makes a video, then I respond, then he responds, and then you have this video. And I'll relink this video in the links. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> point I'm trying to make, of course, you could probably, what could you do? Cause I don't, I don't know if, is my video a video response to Randy's, Randy Tooth's? I don't know. I'll link them. I'll link, just, just look in the description bar. Hopefully it's there. And if it's not there, you know, sue me. And if you can't sue me, get with a, get with a certain counter troll and he can, he can help you sue. Cause apparently, uh, hurting somebody's feelings is now a, uh, a suable offense. Anyway, uh, how many times have I said anyway? This video was bad. Wow. When's the last time I made a bad video? <laughs> so hippies. Hippies, yuppies, and the man. What do those three things have in common? I am going to argue that they are all the same. And they're the same in their core value, and that core value is selfishness. We'll start back in time. Hippies, it's all about me. What makes me feel good? How many, um, how many people had uh, promiscuous sexual partners and drug use while their kids just sort of sat neglected or, or in the case of one of my friends was was raised in a commune with no electricity or anything else while their uh, while their parents had to learn the hard way that if you're gonna have a farm your key crop can't be weed very selfish uh, what's in it for me it's my turn my feelings are important my wants are important and um, I'm gonna live my life uninhibited hippies and I, I see Randy Tooth's point about Gerald Salente, like the baby boomers, they were all into education when they were the ones getting the education. And now that they're a little bit older, education isn't such a big deal. You know, now we're on to medical care. Which brings us to yuppies. Yuppies. They're, they're very into doing what's best for them. You know, they did, did what they had to do in the job market and um, made their way, rose to success, climbed that ladder. And eventually they become the man. And we all know about the man. Don't get me wrong. Hippies might have seemed like they were against the man. But that was, I think, only so that they could hang out with the Black Panthers. Ergo, Forrest Gump. J.N., I know they back Black Panther Party. I'm sorry I beat you up, Jenny. It's just this war and that bastard Johnson. Yeah. 
That's where I'm coming from, y'all. So there you go. Hippies are the man. And they were all along. Man, it's heartbreaking. My heart's broken. Is your heart broken? My heart's broken. And you know what else? You can't eat them. You can't eat them because they're all vegetarians and the vegetarian ain't going no damn meat on his bones. You can't eat them. I'll see y'all later.